Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and I'm very very happy because today I will be doing a collaboration with my talented friend Lisa Lacri from the channel Lacri Fine Art. I will be sketching a horse and then she will paint it. I hope you enjoy it. We begin by sketching a dorsal line. This is the back of the horse. Then we sketch the four quarters, the front part of the body, the round belly and the behind, <laughs> like this. Now the length of the back is about the same as the size of the neck. Measuring this will help you keeping it in proportion. And the head, which is a little bit triangular, we start with the forehead and come down to the nose. And this pronounced bone occupies about half the length of the head and the ears. Now we measure the length of the whole body from the four quarters to the back because that's the same as the height of the horse. And now I sketch a very simplified skeleton of the legs marking where the joints go. The back legs go here and the tail. By the way, this is the reference photo that I am using and that Lisa will be using for her painting. Let's give the shape of the muscles and bones of the legs. I will be uploading a long version of this video to my Patreon account, where I will go in much more detail on how to draw this. Here goes the joint of the heel. I want to share with you that I just recorded a mastermind session that I did with uh, Lisa Lacri, who is a very smart and successful artist, and with legendary Mark Creeley. I'm sure you know him, he has the biggest art channel in the world with over 2.3 million subscribers and he's an authority in the world of manga and comics. In fact, he's the author of 25 books. Anyhow, we sat down and talked about what every one of us is doing and we expressed what difficulties we are having so that the others gave ideas to solve them. It is great to be able to peek into some experts' minds to help you solve your own problems. And that's precisely one of the purposes of the mastermind groups. And I have good news for you. We recorded the whole thing that went on for about an hour because we think some of it may be very helpful to some of you. So stay tuned because I will publish that video on this channel very soon. Good! Let's draw a horizon line and the faraway horse. We draw the dorsal line, the front quarters, the belly, the back quarters, and the neck. Actually, this horse is too small and too far from the other one. I'll try to do it like in the reference photo. It's about this far. And once more we do the dorsal line, front quarters, belly, back quarters, neck of the size of the back, and the height similar to the length of the body. Good, and now we give some shape. I am only doing the silhouette because this horse is going to be far away and with the fog you won't see any detail. In the picture the neck looks a little bit wider, in the belly a little bit smaller. Like this. All right. I will sketch some muscles on this horse so that it doesn't look so empty, even though Lisa, I don't think she's going to use them. As soon as this is over, please go to her channel to check out how she did a beautiful painting from this sketch. Click on the end card or the link below. Very good! We do the last touches, the last details, and it's ready! If you enjoyed the place, give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to Fine Art Tips and go to Lisa's channel. <laughs> you know where to follow me, the links are below. And I will see you on Tuesday.